up you guys and welcome back to my channel if you're new here don't be shy hit that subscribe button so today if you're on the east coast it's been snowy the last three days and i'm still gonna go crazy so i decided to do a whole wash day and also do braids for the first day <sighs> it should be interesting um, but yeah, so I was just going to take you guys along on that journey, do something a little bit different. I haven't really done like a hair hair video before. Honestly, I'm not that great at doing my hair. I do what I can and I do it to the best of my ability, but I'm not like a guru or anything. So I'm literally just taking things from the internet and doing it. Um, but yeah, let's get started. <laughs> So I brought in a chair because my sink is really low and I don't want to be awkwardly bending to y'all. Um, but I'm going to show you. Please do not judge. Oh, I have my hair right now straight out of the bonnet. She's itchy. But it's all good. This is how, I, how it looks right now. This is the length. It is a little bit stretched out just because I had it in a headband. Um, and yeah, it looks super matted down just because I literally have not taken off my bonnet in two days. <laughs> For obvious reasons. Hey, when it's a snow day, you don't be doing nothing, man. So I'm going to be doing a deep condition before I start my whole um, writing process. I'll deep condition, shampoo, and condition. Um, so I pulled this deep conditioner from the internet for low posterity hair. So I was like, I haven't tried one for low posterity hair yet. So I mixed two eggs, olive oil raw organic honey, coconut milk, and then my um, Real Botanicals Aloe and Hemp Infused Frizz Control Conditioner. And I'm gonna just spray that all over my head, man. It doesn't smell bad. I thought it was gonna smell worse, especially with the coconut milk, but it's cool. <music> going on here um you can see this is how my hair naturally looks whenever it's dry whenever it's like you know kind of shrunken <laughs> she's short and that's just how it's looking right now with the deep conditioner treatment in it and i am like really shocked like i have used deep conditioners before and usually they just kind of sit on my hair no matter how much i like feed it through it just kind of like sits it kind of curls up a little bit i've never seen like this much curl from it and it's like holding onto my hair like it literally looks like it's actually seeping through and like going in and it feels really nice also like my curl pattern i don't know how much y'all can see but it looks she looks cute like she's cute both ways but it looks really nice it looks good i'm gonna keep going and yeah basically all of my head all of my head really um it is nice it is like even on my scalp like it feels good and i still have a ton left because i honestly accounted for you can't really see that but i accounted for um it not really sticking and me having to apply a bunch which is what i usually have to do um and that didn't happen this time which makes me really happy so i'm just gonna I think I'm gonna just go through, layer it on my scalp a little bit more, and yeah. And then after that, I have my shower cap here. I'm gonna let it sit. Um, 
My plan is to be between 30 and 45 minutes. Usually I like, sorry, <laughs> usually I like to do a little bit in the back of it, but um, I'm just trying to get this done. I know the braids are gonna take a while and I really don't, I don't like having my hair span out into two days, but that may happen anyway, but I'm trying to start as early as possible. Um, so, I'm just using my spoon <laughs> and just putting a conditioner on my scalp. I um, I usually don't like using or doing DIY deep conditioners with egg just because of um, the smell, but this one actually doesn't have a bad smell to it, which I was really shocked by. Um, usually, it just smells like rotten or like... Oh, because the last one I did, I used mayo, so that was probably why, but this time with the coconut milk, like, it smells like pineapple. <laughs> it like, my finger my hair smells like pineapple juice, which I'm not mad about, um, but I definitely wasn't expecting that. It smells really good, and I think the honey is also a good factor in it, too, and I definitely just put, like, a scoop of honey in my hair. But it really feels nice, it's relaxing. It's a nice smell, so it's not like you're bearing through a disgusting smell the entire time that you're doing your hair, which I love, because I hate it whenever the products have terrible smells. Uh, I have so much of this mixture left. I really would like to use as much as possible. So that's just what I'm doing right now. Just kind of going through and putting it. It's getting hit by this crack. <laughs> and it's looking nice. It's looking real nice, y'all. Like, y'all saw how my hair looked before. And this is how it looks now. I'm like running my fingers through it on both sides. I like see all of my curlies. I have some hair falling now. So, might need to do a little bit more of a trim. But yeah, it looks, it looks pretty great. Um, I'm probably not gonna use the rest of this mixture. That's okay. I use the majority of it, which I did not think was right. I thought I was gonna have to put it in the fridge. But I don't gotta do that. I think I'm good. Alrighty, so the cap is going on. Oh, this is embarrassing. <laughs> One size color. When we have too much hair, it doesn't fit in the shower cap. <laughs> okay. We did it! Awesome. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna leave this in for 30 to 45 minutes, maybe a little bit longer than that. Um, just because I really like how this feels in my hair and I would like for it's to be as moisturized and as soft as possible for whenever I'm blow drying it um, and also be painful as possible. So yeah, I'll check back in with you guys when she's done. All right, you guys, so I'm about to wash this out. It's been sitting for about 30 minutes now, give or take some. It's dripping, my neck is sticky. Um, but you can see it's all up in there. I'm about to wash it out and then I'm going to shampoo and condition and yes also also with my braiding hair I got it from Amazon I'll put the link in the description box but I just soaked it in this big tub um, with white vinegar and like lukewarm water and now I'm just setting them to dry I'm going to roll them up just to make sure they're nice and dry before um, you know braiding it so yep, I just have it rolled up, it's gonna dry, and now I'm going to go wash.
Okay guys, so right now I'm about to just put oil on my hair to prepare to blow dry it and I'm kind of moving really slow um, just because my arms are super tired after washing it. But yeah, that's what this whole entire section is going to be. But I straightened up the front basically completely, waiting on um, all of my hair to dry and then I'm gonna blow dry that as well. Um, and yeah, and we're gonna get the processor it soon. I'm gonna wash my face though because it's really dry from um, washing and it just feels like it's literally gonna peel off. Um, so I'm gonna do that and then. Yeah, so we're about to go on a little adventure. I realized that I didn't have any shine and jam and that's kind of necessary for box braids. So we're gonna go get shine and jam now. <laughs> Yay. You guys, so we just got back from the store. I got, they didn't have shine and jam, so I got Let's Jam, which is essentially the same thing. It's just black. And then I got some oil because I ran out of oil. Um, but I got this. It's like the only one that they have left. And I'm setting up the hair. We're going to get the hair dryer now because it's still kind of wet. As you can see, I'll just get the um, Yeah, we're going to get the hair dryer. Get it all dried up and we are going to start. Alright, y'all. So we just finished blow drying the hair. And I've separated one pack already. This is one pack right now. My lovely mother is going to help me braid. She's here. Like the, you're kind of okay. Yeah. My mom is going to be helping me because I suck at braiding and she's going to help me go through it and we'll see what happens. So, how are we starting? Okay. Are we starting at the front? I just want to see how good the braid will be. Okay. So, we get all the other
I'm real twisty. Did I twist the bag? Oh no, I didn't. I was And that's the front. That means when you go to. It's gonna be my butt. It'll be past your butt. Yeah. Yo, look at her face of judgment right now. Mm -hmm. She's judging me for wanting my braids this long. She's mean. All right, I think we got a system going. How's your system? <laughs> you start, I finish. <laughs> That's a system. <laughs> officially finished half of my head after an hour and a half. Still have all this left, but I think that it looks pretty good. I've been helping, so that's why there are some places that look kind of messed up. It's my fault. <laughs> Still looks good though, yeah. Not as long as what I wanted it to be. It's only about to my waist. I kind of wanted it to be like longer, but somebody had an issue with that. But it's still looking pretty good. We're about to break to eat <laughs> and then we're gonna trudge forward with the rest of my head and hopefully be done um and so far i've used we've used three packs this is three packs of hair um and this is the other two packs you're probably gonna have to go and get another pack um, i might grab that and actually if i put it in now i could probably soak it and it'd still be fine this one's so crazy so yeah, I'm gonna do that and then I'll tell you what came once we're done. All right, y'all, I just got moosed up. Here's the review. Oh, my camera's kind of wonky right now, okay. She's cute, okay. You did a good job, Ma. So I did the ends. They don't look fantastic, but I, it looks like I have box braids. It looks like I have braids. And it did come out kind of long, I guess. Oh, I look cute. Mom, come say bye to the people. <coughs> no. She's choking on her spit. Come say bye to the people. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see more videos like this, obviously hit the comments. Um, like, comment, subscribe. Do something to support. We love to see it. Also, we're at 40 subscribers now. I don't know if you guys saw, but we're slowly but surely building and working our way up. And I'm so glad that you guys have decided to watch me, watch my videos, and support me. Um, and I hope to see that continual support through however long I plan on doing this. Um, so I hope that you guys have a lovely rest of your week and a great Wednesday.